Chapter 1 Prologue You are listening at FameTV.info Shut your trap already. I'm Not Your Woman, Cassidy hissed spitefully, giving him a venomous look that he never saw her wear before. All Adrian could do was stare for a moment, veiling just how thunderstruck he was. But then, he couldn't figure out what made him do what he did next. Maybe it's because her haughtiness had already peeved him to a certain degree. She had already gone too far with disrespecting him like this. That made him reach up and pull her against his chest, taking her lips with his. Caught off guard, Cassidy gasped against his mouth before shutting her eyes closed, recoiling at the suddenness of his action. Due to her lack of experience, she ended up getting helplessly dragged away against her will. Adrian wrapped his arms around her waist, pressing her closer to him. He then put his other hand on the back of her head, leaning in and deepening the kiss. His kisses grew more and more intense in each passing second. The way his lips move against hers is a bit rough and ferocious. Almost desperate to convey a certain emotion that even he wasn't aware of. All Cassidy could do at this point was grip the man's shirt, struggling to squirm around and pull away but to no avail. Oh, so. This is how strong a grown dot up man is, she thought, frustrated and miffed. Adrian laid her on the bed and kneeled down on all fours, so that he was now on top of her. He then continued to kiss the dizzied woman heatedly. Yet careful not to hurt or crush her. Cassidy felt hot at this point. She wasn't sure how much longer she could take this. She felt like she might pass out at any given moment. That's when she started trembling underneath him. A reaction that did not go unnoticed by him. With that, Adrian finally pulled away and unlocked their lips, letting both of themselves get some air. He then reached out his hand to touch her flushed face before caressing it softly, but only to end up having her flinch from the gesture. See. Your body is still reacting the same way as it used to be when you're still. Get off of me. Then came her signature flying kick that was said to be a technique that could ruin a man's future. It just happened that Cassidy brutishly booted him on his groin. Very fatally near to that part to be exact, making him stumble backward in flummox and yelp in pain. Try to touch me like that next time, and I'll make sure to aim for your balls right then, she taunted menacingly before wiping her mouth in disgust. Listen to the full novel at fametv.info, direct link in the description.